What's good, YouTube? Happy on YouTube here, back again once again. Today, people, today we're for episode number eight, numero ocho, of our brand new Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go EV of our brand new Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Pokemon Let's Go EV Let's Play here on the channel, God damn it! Last episode, you guys, we made our way all the way from Bill's house at the Cape, all the way down here to Vermilion City. In today's episode, we're going to explore Million City and maybe even hop on the SS and goddammit. So if you guys are hyped, and of course, we're going to show you support as a private on that be nation. Make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Now, super quick team recap for you guys. Up first, we have Thickums, our Ivysaur, who just hit level 20. Goddamn. Big Dishes, our Pidgeotto is level 20. Sadie, our Pikachu is level 19. Barbara, our Clefairy, level 14. Wendy, our Judo, level 17. I didn't click that button at all. And then Magnolia, our Magikarp, level 13. So let me... Swap you around here. Magnolia and Barbara, I need y'all to desperately level up. That's what I need from you, boy. So, we made it to Vermilion City, so I want to do a little bit of exploratizing. Even if Pokemon are the same level, that doesn't mean one is always strong as, as strong as the other. But a weak Pokemon gets stronger, the more candies you give them, or so I hear. But you don't get EVs or IVs that way, boy. Hello there, son. How would you like to trade your Geodude for my Geodude? Not yet. Well, that's too bad. Not yet, Doug. I only have one Geodude. If I had a second one, I would totes. It's true that higher level Pokemon are stronger, but all Pokemon have weaknesses too, based on their types. Basically, I'm going to have a hard time finding one all-powerful Pokemon. Have you heard of Arceus? Uh, I'm going to write down Geodude trade Vermilion City. So I can come back and get that little Geodude, because I know that's what it is. When my Pokemon was poisoned the other day, it healed its own poisoning, so I wouldn't worry. It must love me lots, don't you think? It's wild how far Pokemon's actually come. That's actually wild how far Pokemon's come. From the days where Pokemon would faint, <laughs> they would just fall over and collapse <laughs> on the side of a route to curing themselves of poison. If you're new to training Pokemon, you should give my place a little visit. It's an empty house, but I've rented it so people can use it as a place to gather and share tips. I mean, this house right here. Whoa. I fed a Nana at Berry to a wild Pokemon and it seemed to calm the Pokemon down. I stopped jumping around so I was able to aim with my Pokeballs easily. Open your eyes. You know, you have a better chance of catching a Pokemon with a Great Ball than a Pokeball. Even though it's not a guaranteed catch, of course. No shit. Aim for the center when the ring is small. I hear that's the trick when throwing Pokeballs. When the ring's color is green, it means that Pokemon's easy to catch, right? And when it's yellow, it's a bit harder. But when it's red, it becomes super hard. Dog, you just open up a house for a bunch of slow kids. 100%. Like, you just... They're all, they all just spout things that are obvious. Did you see it? The SSN is in the harbor right now. I just caught a squirtle that was always getting into mischief. I think it needs a good trainer to set it straight. <gasps> How about I talk to you about it when you caught at least 60 Pokemon? God damn. Okay. Well, that's all three of the starters right there. So we need 30, 50, and 60. Jesus Christ. Such a weird jump, 50 to 60. It's 20 to 50 and then 10. Okay. What's up, my boy? I'm gonna chop a stomp and then land flat. You keep it up. Get you some protein after this. This is my land, all of it. I own everything in this square area here. I have my Pokemon use bulldoze to prepare the site so I can build something here. You do that, dog. You do that. I was gonna say, wait, is Pikachu's tail wagging? I can't tell sometimes. It looks like it's wagging right now as I'm running, just because it's bouncing. So I'm saying, unless it actually is wagging. Plot twist. I get so sweaty. Alright. After doing sports that I end up feeling all grimy. Speaking of which, do you know Grimer? It was born from ocean sludge. Not sweat, I guess. Move, bitch. Why would it be born from sweat? That doesn't even make sense. What's up, boy? I'm particularly fond of the bird Pokemon. Me and my partner Ducks here, or is it Doe, are going to go catch a Spearow soon. Damn, boy, get it! Fuck that Spearow up. I encourage it. Spearow are KKK members. Fuck them up, dog. Burn all the Spearow. Which Pokemon do you prefer, the puppy Pokemon Growlithe or the scratch cat Pokemon Meowth? Growlithe. Oh, you didn't have to answer. I knew the answer. Sorry, it was a stupid question. If you catch five of the puppy Pokemon Growlithe, I'll give you a great Pokemon. You can ride on its back. Is gonna give me catch five Growlithe. Growlithe, I need five of these whores, Doug. We got side quest and let's go. Holy whores! Look at this. Yo, battle me, Magikarp be Magikarp. Mine's better. 
Some Pokemon don't just want to walk with you, some would rather give their trainer a ride. I bet it'd be pretty great to take a ride with a Pokemon that could swim across water or fly through air. Carp, carp, carp. Oh yeah, boy. Oh yeah, boy. Knock, knock. Hello. Would you look at my Pikachu's adorable tail? She would Pikachu. I just adore my seal. It's so lovable. It squeals when I hug it. Don't you need to be in water? Our chairman is very outspoken when it comes to his opinions about Pokemon. I'm the chairman of the Pokemon fan club. I raised more than 100 Pokemon. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. I surely am. So, did you come to visit to hear about my Pokemon? Sure. Look, this nigga is a KKK member. I like how he has a Pikachu and an Eevee in the portrait behind him. He has his lovable Rapidash and then that racist ass Fero. It's like when people have the Confederate flags and it's about our heritage. Well, your heritage is about slavery, dog. So, fuck that. Oh, you see, my favorite Rapidash is the cutest. It's so cute and lovely and smart. It's almost too much to take. Plus, it's really amazing when you stop it to look at it, don't you think so? Oh yes, it looks so stunning and its heart is so kind, you can't help but love it. And when you hug it tight when it's sleeping, it's so warm and cuddly. Plus, it looks spectacular, of course. Oh, and it's simply ravishing when- Oh, look at the time. I kept you too long. Thanks for helping me out. I want you to have this. A Pikachu set. Hello? It's a costume that you can use to dress up your partner Pokemon. You can change it by the back option in the main menu. I like how they're all aware of the main menu. Okay, well, let's peep. Clothing trunk. Change this outfit, boo! What hat do we have? Oh. We have clothes. What? I thought they said it just went in the clothing trunk. What's your best friends to say? I don't know what that means. Speaking of, I was gonna say, this guy mentioned the Pokemon tail. And I know that Sadie is female and the layout, it's a male Pikachu. That's just the sprite, it's what they had. Neat skeet. I didn't even notice it until you guys mentioned it. Uh, am I missing something? I thought you said we had a clothing set. But we have nothing here. We just have the original sports cap. Oh, it's for me! Oh. Oh, that's a fucking Luli. Let's do the damn thing. Let's get all decked out. It's motherfucking Let's Go Pikachu, dog. Now you're really fucking styling, dog. Motherfucking Pikachu bag, dog. Dog, that's lit. I'm gonna leave Pikachu dressed like that. I'm gonna leave Sadie dressed like that. So she's dressed like me, and I'm dressed like her. Ah! <laughs> Yo, champ in the making! Beyond this point is a million City Jam, but you'll need to chop that tree down first! You don't know how to chop a tree? Hmm, well as I recall, the captain of the SSN was an expert at chopping trees. Are you telling me to go to SSN? Is that what you're instructing me to do? Directing me to go and do? I didn't check out the Mart in, in Cerulean City after I got my badge. There are wicked people out there who use Pokemon to do awful things. Stealing other Pokemon, selling them for ridiculously high prices. And you want to know who these bad folks all gather? Team Rocket, that's where. Ooh, excuse me, who is this? Hold the fuck up. I think Pokemon can be good or bad. It depends on the trainer. Yeah, you you keep facing that way, Doug. Holy shit, Game Freak. Relax. Please. This is supposed to be a kid's game. <laughs> Walking here, selling items and shit. Got badass bitches in the corner. Hold the fuck up, Doug. I'm gonna sell this bitch too. Actually, no. I feel like I need that for something. Uh, I'm gonna keep... Actually, I'm gonna sell this. So I will never fucking use it. And I'm gonna sell this. If this were a Nuzlocke, I'd sell that Revive, too. But it ain't, boy! So what do you have? You have Super Potions for sale. Yeet. Dog, we stay strapped with stacks, dog. It's actually kind of wild. I'm gonna buy a couple lures. I should use these more often, to be honest. Huh. Okay, I think we're good on Pokeballs and whatnot. And now we're good on potions, so fuck the bullshit. Fuck this shit, I'm out! 
So, I know we had two episodes of just battling trainers back to back. I kind of want to explore over here as well, but I will save it. Route 11 and Diglett's Cave will save. Oh, there's another coach trainer. Hold the fuck up, dog. <laughs> Hold the fuck up. Hold the absolute fuck up. Wait, I can't train. I'm gonna say, we have Wendy out front. But I can't very well train Wendy. I need to... I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go up against a bunch of water type trainers. What is it, Magikarp? You're surrounded by all this water? Magnolia is looking happy at the ocean. Oh, happy for you. The Essence Inn is a famous luxury cruise ship. It visits Vermilion Port just once a year. Damn, hold up. I didn't check out this house. I walked right past it. The allure, the blue glow of the maw distracted me, yes. This thing here isn't for resting your feet on, you know. You know, it's for tying up a boat. You can do both at once, you know. You don't have to be a dick about it, jackass. Give old people a bad rap. I'm getting my pigeon to fly a letter to Saffron City in the north. Cuckoo! Do. Gee, I wish I could take a trip aboard the SSN someday. I could make new friends all over the world. They should let you take a trip on the SSN. Well, they did in second gen. They did. They let you go from Kanto to Johto on the SSN. That was lit, dog. That was such good. That was, oh, second gen so good. So good, so good, dog. We are dripping in this fucking all yellow, dog. Look at this. Fucking swagged all the way out. Hey, boy. Welcome to the SSN. But not so fast. You have a ticket, young fellow? There you go. Arrgh! Yep, that'll do. Welcome aboard the SSN. Oh, and that's not all. You're the 100th guest to join us aboard the SSN today, so here you go. Please enjoy this breezy outfit as you feel the salty air on your skin. A sailor set, dog. Well, if we're gonna sail the high seas, I think it's only appropriate. Can we get a sailor set for the... For a Pikachu? Please and thanks. And I was gonna say, good continuity too. Not a lot of people realize that Saffron City is to the north. Yeah, boy! These sailor shorts, dog. Sailor shoes, they don't match at all. You got a sailor bag? It's got a little life ring on it. Does Sadie get a sailor outfit? <gasps> yes, she does. Oh my god. We're gonna be sailored up. Oh! We're gonna be sailored up, dog. Oh my god, look at us. Look at us. I'll swap back once we get off the SSN, but it's only appropriate for right now. Look at this big old boat. God damn, boy. Holy shit. Dog, this music. Oh, there you are, Nappy. Popping shitty penguin. Thanks again for the ticket. This ship is huge. <gasps> shut up, 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 that's blue. Blue, red, and green on that same screen. Thanks again for the ticket. The ship is huge and it's full of trainers. Bonjour, if it isn't nappy and shady. Don't think I'd be seeing the two of you here. Uh, hey, Blue, are you taking a cruise? Not hardly. I got invited to this, to this exclusive party for trainers, but I'm pretty much done with this scene. I got plenty of party favors, too. Here, I can even share one with you. A Shalor Sable. Isn't Shalor City in Kalos? Does the SSN travel to all different regions? I know it goes to Johto and Kanto, but does it perhaps go to Kalos as well? You put the Shalor Sable in your medicine pocket. More importantly though, you wanna know what I overheard at the party? You guys know about Team Rocket, right? Uh, I've battled them before. Seriously? You must be fearless or something, kid. Anyway, the point is this, Team Rocket is a dangerous group and they're trying to use Pokemon to make themselves rich. I might do some digging into what it is they're really after. And the two of you better stay out of their path. He's so fucking cool. He's so fucking cool. Team Rocket, huh? Nappy, if you get tangled up with those jerks again, you should call me. Sure thing, Shady Penguin, I will. Wait, did they flip all the, the rooms? Because we can't walk forward? Oh, they flipped all the rooms. That's so dope. They're all on the top side of the screen now. Excuse me, ma'am. You look tired. Would you like to take a short rest? Thanks. 
I'm glad everyone's looking refreshed and chipper now. Well, I'm sorry for fussing over you. It's just because you look like my little brother. It's the sailor outfit. It's gotta be. This is a huge trash can, dog. That trash can's bigger than the pillow. The fuck? Knock, knock! Hello! We're coming into all these rooms, dog. You insolent pup! How dare you barge in! This thing has a Growlithe, I'm pretty sure. If I remember correctly from the old games, Gentleman Arthur has a Growlithe! And we can train our Jill dude against a Growlithe, but don't look at the battle background! Oh my god, it's just delicious. It's just fucking delicious. You only have one mod, so I'm not stealth rocking. Sorry, Doug. Sorry, Holy shnikes, this thing is level 18. Are we ready for this next gym? I don't know if we are. We might not be. Yaga! Get fucked, Doug. Get fucked, boy! Get fucked, boy! If we just got a ground type move, I will go into this gym with nothing but the utmost of confidence. I just need magnitude. That's it. That's it. Can you just learn magnitude? Here. We did this last episode, I'll do it again. Okay, Google. What level does Geodude learn magnitude? Doesn't tell me. Let's see here. Thanks for the battle, guy. Appreciate it. So I'm guessing this is based off 7th gen, since there are a load of mods in here. I'm guessing, I know it's based off 7th gen. Let's see here. What level do we learn either magnitude or a first ground type move? One or the other is dope. You guys know Geodude is base 100 defense and base 80 attack? He's got base 20 speed, but that's really good for a stage 1 mod. Oh my god! Paint me like one of your French girls. This nigga, I don't know. I don't want to be in here. I'm uncomfortable. I'm uncomfortable. Dog, Geodude's base, he has base 300 stat total, and a third of that is his defense. And we're bold nature. That's insane. Uh, okay, so we get... Magnitude at level 12? What level do we catch this Geodude at? The next move he gets is Bulldoze at 22. So I guess we're training this Geodude until 22 because we need it for this next gym. Excuse me, creepy man. Staying in bed, doing nothing during my much-awaited cruise trip. Oh, what a luxury. He's waiting for room service to come in and catch him. That's what he's waiting for. I can tell, boy. Ooh. The SSN looks so fucking gorgeous, Doug. No. Trash can with a hyper potion in it? This is bullshit. Whoa, what are y'all doing in here, boy? They about to shoot up. Hello? My partner Machoke is super strong. He has enough strength to even shove big rocks out of the way as if they were nothing. Yeah, boy. Look at them pecs. I just want to walk up and just smack them pecs. Just, you got it, boy. You got it. Speaking of, there's a video on YouTube of Hornswoggle, like, boxing Biggie's pecs. Fucking hilarious. What's up, dog? You know what they say about sailors? <laughs> no, I don't know what they say. We're all itching for a fight after ages at sea. That's not what I heard. It's not what I heard about sailors. <laughs> you know, this is a good Christian PG Let's Play, so I'll keep what I've heard about sailors to myself. All right, Wendy. This is the test right here. I need you to take this motherfucker down. Now, it's a slow poke, so you gotta be faster than this. Ladies and gentlemen, headbutt. Alright. That's all the time I've got for today. No. Wendy, no. What's going on here, Wendy? Please. Please, Wendy. Look at Sadie in her little sailor outfit. Oh my god. So I don't think Winnie will get any experience for this. I don't think this... Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, I don't think the Zippy Zap will kill, but... It did. That was a critical hit. It's always a critical hit with Zippy Zap. Giggity goddamn. Giggity 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 goddamn. Right, good battle, mate. Okay, sure. You got it. You got it, dog. You got it. Okay, so what I'm going to do, this triggers me. Why did I leave it in? I knew it wasn't going to live. 
it triggers me because I'm trying to, like, we're on a timer. He's on a timer. We're on a timer because we need this ground type move before we go to take on Serge's gym, which most likely will be in the next episode. So I need Wendy to level up and learn magnitude. I don't know why you don't. Well, whoa, wait, what? Options, tank speed, fast. Oh, what? Oh. That's dope. Holy shit, I didn't even know I could do that. But what I was gonna say is, I need you to learn Bulldoze, not Magnitude. I can swear we caught this at like level 8 or something. It didn't get a chance to learn Magnitude. That's really weird. Um, what am I doing? Oh, it just leveled up. Okay, how many just Rare Candy I have? How many just Rare Candy I have on Wendy right now? She just leveled up. I need I need you to... I would really like to use it on Barbara, but I need you leveled up, Wendy. I need you leveled up. Even if you don't learn your... What? I'm not going to do that. I would like to, but... Okay, so then the movesets are drastically different. Because on Bobo just now, it said it gets self-destruct at 24 before it evolves. I do specifically remember seeing that. It gets it at 24 before it evolves. So, that might have been why we didn't get, um, magnitude. Because the movesets in this game are just different. It's not 7th gen. It's not strictly 7th gen. That's wild. They totally overhaul Pokemon just for this game. Alright, Doug, what are you doing in here? And you know, like, that's a cool thing because, like, it makes the game different, but at the same time, unless it's going to be canon, I like feisty kids like you. I'd like to really get you with my wrench. But I mean, unless. <laughs> let me. Let me hit them nuts with my wrench. Uh, but I mean, unless it's gonna be canon, which I highly doubt it will be. Maybe they're gonna have their own canon universe for Let's Go games. Like, I can see them doing, like, Let's Go Meryl, Let's Go Snubble. If Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee do well. I can't touch this thing, dog. I need a ground type move. Why did you remove it? I thought this game was supposed to be easier. This is whack. I thought this game was supposed to be easier, and you're moving things around and taking things, and it just. Uh! But what was I gonna say? If they make this game canon, that means moves have to be changed from here on out. But I. I highly doubt that this will become overall canon, like this is the next main series game. Everybody was saying this is the next main series game, yada yada yada. I don't see it. I, I, for the same reasoning as before. A, this would drastically dumb down Pokemon, which I can't see them removing abilities and removing weather and all this extra shit that they've spent years and years implementing and fine tuning, all for the sake of making a new main series game as this. I think our next main series game will probably be on the Switch, um, but... I think this is starting a third continuity, like a universe of its own that exists in. I don't know, to me, I consider this a side game. I know we've had this discussion debate a thousand times before the games came out, but especially now that I'm playing them and seeing how different it actually is from actual core main series Pokemon, like it's very similar, but at the same time it's very different. That's like saying Pokemon Go is now officially, well technically it is officially canon. The world of Pokemon Go is officially canon because Meltan is a thing. It has its own Pokédex number in the National Dex. So that means that Meltan and Melmetal will be in Generation 8, which is a no-brainer, but I'm just following the thought process here. So I was going to say, that would be like saying Pokémon GO is now officially the main canon storyline for Pokémon. And we all know that that isn't true. So We got an Ether two episodes ago, an Ether last episode, now an Elixir. We out here doing the damn thing. Look at how fucking adorable you are in your goddamn Sailor outfit, shady as shit. God, you're so here, eat, eat. No, wait, wait, wait. Here. No, 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 no. I want you to take this, put it in your mouth. Eat it. Eat it. I want you to take this, put it in your mouth. Eat it. I want you to take this, put it in your mouth. Eat it. Yes, you are fucking adorable. You are fucking adorable, and you must be protected at all costs. 
Give me those fucking cheeks. Give me those fucking cheeks. I want these fucking cheeks. Give me these goddamn cheeks. Yes! Yes! Give me a high five. Give me a high five. You see me right here? I love this Pokemon, though. Peach is so fucking adorable. So fucking adorable. Alright, dog. Come here. Run these hands, boy. Even sailors have Pokemon. Everyone has Pokemon, dog. It's not even sailors. Like, sailors are somehow exempt from Sailor Huey. You don't even sound that bright. Okay, we're not playing this game again. We just water gun and Oko me. I'm bold, not calm. Well, you wouldn't be calm. You'd be careful, right? Because calm lowers attack. I'm pretty sure. All right, Sadie, did you do the damn thing here? Please, thank you. We got two level 20s and two level 19. We need to get those level 19s up to level 20 as well. Then we got two mons that are just struggling. Magnolia and uh, Barbara are just, I don't know what to do with these two. I'm still undecided on what to do with Barbara. I don't know if I should keep Barbara or replace it with the Jigglypuff we caught. I really want the Jigglypuff. But, like, I know Clefable is so much better than Wigglytuff. I don't know. Is this really the game to worry about, like, how good our mons are? I don't think it is. If there's one Pokemon I think Wendy could live a water gun from, I think it's Poliwag. But we'll never know, because this Zippy Zap is about to dicky dick this goddamn Poliwag. Holy shit, dog. HP drops so quickly. It's just not fair. It's just not fair. Poliwag just caught, man. So very vicious. Holy shit. Fuck out of here, dog. I just want to see Wendy level up. Hopefully, we can get enough experience. Maybe we'll get to like level 20 by the end of this episode. 21 will be perfect. If we can get a 21 by the end of this episode, that means like the trainers in the gym. Maybe we can get to level 22, or maybe even like after the first mod, we get to 22. The gym leader's first mod, Sarge's first mod. Hello, stranger. I can I can't tell if you're from the seas or mountains, but stop and chat. All my Pokemon are from the sea. Hey, that's cool, dude. Happy for you, bro. All your Pokemon are from the sea. Fisherman Barney. Oh god. Well, looks like we're gonna zippy zap your entire squadron. Come on, Wendy! Wait, you don't have zippy zap. Hold on, Wendy! Hold the fuck up. Also, I mentioned this two episodes ago, but I don't remember. Well, I, well, it hasn't reset yet. I don't know what causes the little Pikachu assist to reset. What causes it to, to make it so that we can utilize that again. Hey, can you not? Actually, you won't get the chance to. Because my speed stat's higher than yours, so fuck your quick attack. Eat this Zippy Zap, dog. I love how Zippy Zap's animation looks like Pikachu's Z-move. Or one of Pikachu's Z-moves. The 10,000 or 90,000 gigabolts, whatever the fuck it is. Yeet Ski. Oh, we're level 20 already. How did I miss that? I think it happened last battle. Alright, Sadie, do the damn thing, dog. Literally. Zippy Zap is horsey. Bop! Be gone! And you see, this is my worry. This is my concern. Leading with Wendy here is that Wendy wouldn't get the actual true chance to shine and grow. I just want Wendy to do well. Alright, well, we've come down here and Harassed all these people on their vacations. <laughs> I'm gonna go back up and heal and harass the other half of the ship. I think maybe I'll go in the kitchens and fuck with the chef. <laughs> They're in there whipping it, and I'm about to go in there and be like, hey, 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 we're gonna battle? Hey, 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 can we battle? Hey, 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 can we battle? Hey, is this thing on? Hey, can we battle? Yeah, you don't have to tell me I look like your little brother every single time. I get it. I understand. I'm aware. I know. Hey, boy! The passengers are restless after being out to sea so long. You might get challenged to battle by some of these really bored ones. You know what's good for them? They won't do that. Waiter! Yes, you, waiter! I need a slice of cake! The finest custard cake you have! Well, I mean, I got some cakes, and... You got some cakes, and we can exchange cakes if you're trying to, baby girl. I'm telling you, Game Freak is just up to no good. I mean, I guess the trainer class is beauty, but... Come on, dog. Holy shit! I didn't see anything! I don't know what y'all doing in here. I didn't see anything. Actually, let me get in on this. I'm down to hop in this bed with this wiggly tough. Pew, pew, pew. I always travel with wiggly tough. I never leave home without it. A world cruise is so elegant and nice. They ain't there doing some kinky shit with wiggly tough, dog. I can imagine. I feel like wiggly tough's like a dominatrix. Ooh, 
Speaking of dominatrix, dominate me! I collected these Pokemon from all around the world. So I better see Amon from Unova. I better see Amon from Kalos. Beauty Nikki. Now, you know, at the time when this game first came out, <laughs> the only world was Kalos. Or not Kalos, Kanto. So to say you collect these mods from all around the world, she wasn't lying. She actually wasn't lying, dog. All right, Wendy. This is just for you. They're even throwing by clicking mirror move first. She had to have known that you were slower. You're a rock. You're literally a rock with arms. Yes, Wendy. Yes. Get that experience. Get that experience. Get that experience. Get that experience. Whoa, you got a lady Pikachu too. It's the first time I've seen an actual Pikachu in battle. Whoa, 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 there you go. Don't you do it again, whore. All right, good job. You keep it up. God damn it, Wendy. Wendy, we can win this. Oh no. Wendy, please. My Pikachu sucks ass. Yaga, be gone, thought. My Pikachu's much stronger than that. <laughs> My double kicks do much more damage on rock types than yours did. Just throwing it out there. Oh, you bitch! I didn't even see you tucked behind the couch! You sneaky asshole. Youngster Tyler. Alright, buddy. Bring out this fucking ma- oh, Fuck. Uh, okay, we're bold. Base 100 defense. Let's try it. I'm willing to roll the die here. Yeah, boy. Good job, Wendy. Keep it the fuck up. Yeah, boy. Yeah, fuck out of here with your whack ass Maggie. Don't you ever hide behind a couch and challenge me to a battle again, idiot. Youngster Tyler. I'm like youngster idiot. I'll scab out the other name. Make you have two band aids, bitch. Alright. Ha! Ha! We're cruising around the world, my children and I. This is your daughter? She must get her genes from her father. Because you don't look nothing like her. Just being honest, you don't look nothing like her, though. Excuse me, pardon me. Alright, now, I know I said this before, and I was determined to get through Mount Moon in an episode, but I'm determined to get through SSN in an episode, damn it. It will happen. All these motherfuckers want to fight. And you know, I'm not one to turn down a goddamn battle. So I have to fight them. Slowly cold, like I have to. Shh, I'm an agent for the International Police. I'm on the trailer of Team Rocket. They're up to nothing good. All right, I have a feeling you might be Looker, and I'm not into that. Move. Be gone. Looker is a dummy. Bonjour. I am Liweta on the ship. I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, let's strong the Silent Tape Tribune. Okay. You dress up just like a sailor, but hey, so are we. Talk about this fucking feast, dog. Oh my god, I fuck all this up. I'm so busy, I'm getting dizzy. You have to give me room here. Oh, look at these fucking berries. Have you ever wondered about these silver domes we put on top of the food? They're called cloches. They keep hot dishes from cooling. Let's see if that's actually how you pronounce that. Is it cloches? Okay, Google. How do you pronounce cloches? Okay. It said... Cautious. I want cloches. All right, this is according to Merriam-Webster. Closh. You said it right. Closh. You're there, mon petit. We're busy here. Out of the way, shoo shoo. Magic card, get the fuck over here. A super repel. Again, what is the point in repels, dog? There's no point. All right, there's nothing in that trash can either. Hey, boy, <clears throat> I am indeed le chef. Le main course today is my flavorful whirlpool sushi. Though le guests may complain that it's fish yet again. I mean, what do you expect on a... <laughs> snivel, snip. I get to peel onions, snivel. I like how they're all doing the same motion. A tiny mushroom in that can. He's lying. Have you heard about Snorlax? It's a real glut. No other Pokemon eats and sleeps the way Snorlax can. Okay, okay, okay. I want the I want the trash can. Fuck off! I want the trash can. 
Can I honestly not click on this? Sh okay. I peel spuds every day. Hum hum. You just can't click on those trash cans. That's whack. Game Freak, put shit in the trash cans again. It's worth it. You're just being cocks. Big old cocks. What's up, Doug? The ship. She's a luxury liner that Pokemon trainers the world over love to get a ride on. Every time we pull them to port, we have a fancy party and invite all the best trainers to attend. Oh, you're so kind. So fucking kind, Doug. What's up, dog? Liking that shelter? Our captain is a sword master. He's awesome at using chop down. They'll say he'll teach his move to anyone who shows potential. Oh, yeah? Whoa. Pika? Oh. <gasps> Sadie seems very excited. It seems like Sadie wants to see what's up up ahead on the ship. Whew, scrubbing decks is hard work. Are you two trainers? Oh, look at that drink! Hey, matey, let's do a little jig. I want whatever's in that glass. God damn. That's what I'm looking for. Sailor Edmund. What's up, fat boy? Bring out that polywag. Bring that nigga here, dog. Bring that nigga here. Come on, Wendy. I know you can do it. Uh, you know what? Let's test it out. Can Wendy, in fact, live a water gun from a polywag? Answer is yes. But that's all we're living from this polywag. <laughs> that's literally it. That's all we're living from this polywag. Anything else will absolutely annihilate us. Excuse me. Pardon me. Say do the damn thing. Again, attention to detail. I like how they do that. How like every other mom comes out of the Pokeball, but this one, like, you just toss. Sadie comes off our arm, off our shoulder. Eat skate, dog. This ugly ass polywag out of here, boy. Out of here, boy. Thank you. Yes. Well, it doesn't mean shit to me anymore, because we don't know if we're gonna get Oh, oh, oh amnesia. You know what? Sing can go. Amnesia, I'll gladly take. Because I don't know when we're going to get Magnitude. Clearly it's not level 20. They upped fucking self-destruct, so I don't know when we're going to get what. Who knows, Doug? It's very aggravating. Maybe I should just look up, see if they have um, a different learn set. They might just have that. They might could possibly very well. This party is winding down. It's about time for the ship to set sail. Come here, boy. Ahoy there. Do you not get seasick sea sick on ships? Yo. Come through, dog. Sailor Trevor. Come through. Let me clap them cheeks, boy. Come here, boy. All right, dog. Look here. Wendy, I know you got this. Can we live a water gun from a seal? Survey says seal's just a water type, not a rock. I mean, not an ice type. Now, Aqua Jet, though. Oh, we're living that. Big shit, we're living that. Base winter defense, bold nature, too. I swear to God, if you have water gun, we'll live another one. Yeet. Oh! Orchids be a critical fucking hit, and Wendy can't get shit. That's ass. That's so ass. I'm gonna eat your fucking ass now just because of that. Come here. Sadie, obliterate. You have one job. You have one job. It is to obliterate. Zippy zap. Be gone, thought. You would have thought. Be gone, thought. Off my screen and out of my face. Ugly. You want a crit? We'll trade crits for crits. How about that? How about that? I'm a chop. No, I'm gonna stay the fuck in. Do the damn thing. Sadie, do the damn thing, dog. Zippy zap the fuck out this whore. There's no abilities, so guts can't happen. Well, I can't paralyze. I just get crits. You got mock punch in this game? Do they upgrade that too? Because if not, that focus energy don't mean shit, boy. Gone, ugly. Be gone, ugly. Off my screen, ugly. Big Dish is level 21. I want Wendy to be level 21. Well, at least we're guaranteed to get Stealth Rocks off in this gym battle. <laughs> to say the least. Why was Sadie so excited for this? I don't feel good. I came here for some air because I get seasick. <gasps> Pika P. Pika 
You gaze over the wide open sea together with Sadie. Sadie seems really happy. Aw. That's so adorable. Well, I'm gonna break a promise again to you guys. I don't know, these parts just take longer than I expected. And again, I want to keep our hours of powers worth, like, the excitement and thrill of the hour of power. So I'm going to run down here and heal, and we will wrap up the v or the very end of the SSN. Sorry, Zeddy, you're too adorable right now. Too adorable right now. We'll wrap up the very end of SSN, start of the next episode, and I think we'll be taking on Lieutenant Surge as well. So, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, and of course, I want to show you support as a problem of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you're already, no, oh, your support is greatly appreciated. And I'll catch you guys next time. Until then, I'm out of this bitch. Bye!